first we're gonna open some control panel to start or um, on the Apache and MySQL. <coughs> this is for the database to access the website application. And second is we open the browser, which is the first Microsoft Edge, and access the local host, Alo CC. And it automatically diverts you to the homepage. So first you can see the minimal um, design of the website application and uh, let's assume that we have no uh, account so first we're going to see stem student uh, cbscs as a student at student.atc.ph we use your name bscs191 and password is ss191 wait let's assume for a healthy body which is 72 and the height is uh, 176 birthday Similar to mine, uh, November 25,000. And lifestyle, we will assume that since uh, we will rate the lifestyle from not active to active in a scale of 1 to 5, from not active to active, and this since the weight and height is proportional, or we can assume that this is physically fit, so let's sign up for 5. And now we have registered for the new user, which is BSS. One eight one, and let's access this by using the password SS one eight one. Uh, next, you can see the suggested food balance, which is using the linear search algorithm, and we limit the output here by four. So by clicking the refresh suggested food button, like I said in the PowerPoint, uh, it runs through the linear search algorithm again, passing the array to the session of the user. And or if the use session is already existing, it overwrites it. Then for the calories, um, we simply count the number of calories intake today and the food archive. So let's assume since we are a new user, we're gonna create one later. And in the food diary, since we have no food diary and we are a new user, we don't have food diary yet. So let's assume we ate pork today. And let's say it's pork CC. It's 130 calories. And the uh, program will count the calories intake today, the food archive diaries, the total food in the database that you added, and the number of food you intake today. Uh, now, in the food diary, you can see that it reflects what is in the database. And this uses the merge sort algorithm from descending and ascending. And this can be done by using or clicking the up and or arrow button. So let's go to the other account with numerous food diary. Which is my account. Uh, by logging into my account, you can see that uh, let's arrange this by ascending. The uh, earliest food diary that was stored was in November 11 and November 12 brother 2020 and the latest was November 14 2020 there are no food added today yet uh, the food arc of diaries reflects the total number of diaries or variants in your diary so let's assume the we ate numerous Vines today and reach the 1800 limit calorie limit. Uh, saying that we check this all, we need more 1k. There, um, we reach the limit of 2800 calories, and the user or me. Uh, intake 2957 calories, which is uh, just a warning. Uh, the person can still add variance that they intake, but uh, they have to notice or be reminded that they have reached their limit. And that's it for today. Aloha.